talk about your exact cast now, Margaret. Two things: cold, gray, dreary. Okay, and, more and than you two left things. out the rain. <laughs> and the rain and wet. <laughs> We've had three quarters of an inch of rain at the airport. It was about a half an inch over at Audubon on the North Shore. Two thirds of an inch of rain. The good news is the rain is going to move out and the sun is going to shine. Let me give you the timing. So here is a look at what's happening. Obviously, we have rain moving over southeast Louisiana and across the southeast. What we have is an area of low pressure offshore that over time is going to be moving to the south. High pressure is to our west and it's going to move our way. It's going to push this mess to the south. In fact, look at our water vapor imagery. Do you see this dry air? It's moving southward, but we still have some high clouds to the west that will be moving across our area. So we can zoom in. There's that clearing line over there by Alexandria. Still some showers right over southeast Louisiana and along the Mississippi Gulf Coast. But it's moving out. In fact, in the metro area right now, I'm not seeing any rain, maybe a little bit of drizzle. But here's that activity that extends from Dulac over near Lockport, extending to near Poydras, all moving to the east. Rainfall amounts, well, two tenths of an inch of rain was showing up on the North Shore, but we heard in Slidell that they had six tenths. And then along the coast down here by Boothville, it was about an inch of rain. And that's actually what the models were indicating yesterday. So it was fairly accurate. Here is a look at the big forecast model. The rain moves out 8 o'clock. It's out of here. North Shore, you're clearing. Still some clouds on the South Shore. Here we are at midnight. A little bit of cloudiness still in the area. But going into the morning, clear skies. Now remember, clear skies with that light north wind, temperatures are going to be going down. So the headlines, rain is ending. It's going to be cold in the morning, low to the upper 30s. And then the sun is coming out tomorrow. I'm so looking forward to that. Here's the low moving out, high pressure building in, north flow, high temperatures tomorrow, mid 50s, sunny skies. And then let's go into Saturday. That high pressure moves to the east. It's going to be cold in the morning, low temperatures in the 30s, but during the day a little bit warmer. We're going to be near 60 degrees. Then as we go into Sunday, a front is approaching, lows in the 40s, so not as cold as what we're expecting over the next couple of days, and then a weak front moves through. High temperatures will be in the low 60s. But for this kind of weather, got this twit pick in for Jay Ray. I mean, was it a perfect gumbo day today or what? And then out my window, yeah, just cloudy cold, gray. Morning low temperatures were in the low 40s. Notice at the airport 43, the high temperature 46 with that cloud deck, temperatures just did not change today, way below that average of 62. You look to the northwest, we still have a northerly flow there, and you're going, why were they so much warmer? Not that they were a lot warmer, they had clear skies, so they had some warming taking place. As for us, the cloud deck all day. 46 now at the airport. Visibility pretty good. Every now and then we're getting some low visibility, and that's with the rain. Temperatures about the area mid to the upper 40s. Still that north wind, 9, 13 miles per hour, which does make it feel colder. Wind chills in the upper 30s to the low 40s, so a little lower than the actual temperature. Going into the evening, we stay in the 40s. But in the morning, we're all in the 30s and we'll warm up slowly by noontime near 50 degrees. So morning lows low to the upper 30s. Daytime highs tomorrow climbing right there into the mid 50s. Here is a look along the coast. Exercise caution with those winds north at about 15 to 20. Let's look at the exact cast. And there you can see going into the afternoon, not warming up a lot. High temperatures mid 50s, but a lot warmer than we were today with that high of 46. Saturday looking nice, high of 60. Sunday looking nice, a high of 63. And next week looking pretty good. A stronger system moves our way for Thursday. That's going to be our next day with the big rain chance.